Uh, some other stories we're following right now, new at five in Manchester overnight. A man was arrested after going around Main Street, smashing windows and doors. And Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Eliza Krasinski joins us now live on Main Street with a look at the repairs. Eliza. Hey, Stephanie and Mark, well, you can see some boarded up windows and doors. This is actually smashed glass, smashed windows over here. Majority of the damage happened between Cottage and Main Street here in Manchester. The business owner of uh, this building that I just spoke with, she just walked inside and she told me the same person who did this last night is the same person who did this exact same thing last year. We were a little shocked, you know, it's like, First thing in the morning, seeing all this. Just after midnight, police say this man, Daniel Caesar, walked down Main Street with two metal rebar rods, smashing windows and doors at businesses. The full gospel interdenominational church office windows smashed. It's just one of many businesses that need repairs. It was like sad that somebody was so angry that they took it out on personal property of people. Officers ordered him to drop the metal rods and get on the ground. After he ignored them, officers deployed a taser. That didn't work, and he approached a police cruiser, hitting the passenger window with the metal rod. Officers tackled him and took him into custody. He's obviously dealing with some mental health issues, and that just makes us have compassion and, you know, sadness for him. Renee says repairs can be done, but she's just glad no one was hurt. Luckily, he, nobody got into the building and everything was secure. And like I said, the police were amazing at just communicating with us and making sure that, you know, we were settled and everything was okay. Caesar was arrested. He appeared in court this morning. He is charged with seven counts of criminal mischief, breach of peace, threatening, and carrying a dangerous weapon. This is an ongoing investigation. Reporting live in Manchester tonight, Eliza Krasinski, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.